there are endless restaurant options in Dallas, right? But this one in particular has based their menu off of one of our favorite sandwiches. Now it's time for a bit of nostalgia and plenty of cheesy delights with Stephanie Mendez. If you're like me, you love a good comfort food, and one place here in Bishop Arts is taking one of your comfort food faves and boozing it up a little bit. Let's go see what they're all about. So Dallas Grilled Cheese opened in January of 2014 here in the Bishop Arts District, um, and it is what it is. I mean, it's grilled cheese, but we call it grilled cheese with an attitude. We're a company that likes to play with our food, uh, reinvent the grilled cheese. We offer um, just anything from the basic, classic grilled cheese. We offer a bacon chicken ranch grilled cheese, a cattleman's grilled cheese, which comes with uh, smoked brisket on it, um, and a jalapeno popper. I mean, we just like to play with our food. Besides the classic, um, the American cheddar, you know, we do Monster, we do Gouda, we even have a spicy uh, pepper jack and ghost pepper, ghost pepper cheese, which is great. We do offer cocktails. We have uh, um, one of our most popular, two most popular actually, is our um, lavender blueberry fizz. It's made with fresh blueberries, vodka, and lemon juice. Uh, our second one is our blackberry bourbon lemonade. It's also made with uh, fresh blackberries, of course bourbon, and lime juice. We do have a location here in Bishop Arts. We, uh, our second location has been open since uh, 2017. is in the Mockingbird Station. And also, we do have two food trucks uh, that are always roving around Dallas. Yeah, and just feel free to come out, bring your family, bring your friends. You know, it's a great place for a first date or a great place for a family gathering. We'd love to have you. All right, I'm taking over here, guys. We're making here just a classic grilled cheese, my friend, right? Okay, a, a, a classic grilled cheese. Now, the process here is a little bit different. I've learned that it's not your basic toasting of the grilled cheese. You don't just flip it over like you normally would. So what's, what's, what's the process? Do I just look at it? Okay. <laughs> so then this way, you don't flip it and toast it on both sides. It just toasts perfectly in this oven. Yeah. And so when you put it up in the salamander, both sides and the cheese is going to toast perfectly. So this is melting the cheese. Uh -huh. I don't make my grilled cheese at home like this. <laughs> <laughs> I've made grilled cheese in the microwave, if we're being honest. <laughs> Are Michael, which one should I dig into first? So let's start with the Cuban. The Cuban. Right. All right. Yeah. Just gonna go into these things blind. I'll eat whatever, anyways. Oh, this looks amazing. Is that right, Michael? Which one is this one? Here you have my favorite. This is the bacon chicken ranch. Okay, I heard a bit about this one. I tried to make this one back there, and um, they demoted me to the regular grilled cheese. So bacon ranch. This is a cheese lover's dream, and even if you're not a cheese lover, I'm pretty sure this place can convince you. For all things Dallas Grilled Cheese Company, head to our website at cw33.com. Cheers, friends.